All right, welcome back everyone. Dr. Ben here, not a real doctor, and nutrition is the name of the game today. Everyone says you are what you eat, but that's not exactly accurate. Actually, you are what you absorb. And to demonstrate this, I'm gonna use my favorite example. Skim milk says right here, vitamins A and D, grade A. You put this with some oatmeal, some blueberries, some fat-free yogurt, and you were following all of the recommended dietary advice. So what's the problem? The problem is vitamins A and D are fat soluble. So unless you have more fat in that breakfast, you're not gonna get any of the vitamins A or D out of this milk. You can't absorb fat soluble vitamins out of the presence of fat. So in the case of skim milk, there's actually a financial reason why companies push it. Once you take all the milk fat out of this, it can be turned into heavy cream, half and half, or cheeses, things like that, which can be sold at a much higher profit margin. It's called value added. But there's not a whole lot of nutrition in skim milk. My point isn't to demonize skim milk. It's just to make you aware that what you eat is not nutrition. What you absorb is nutrition. So get most of your food from whole food sources, not the grocery store. Try local farms, farmer's market, or your own backyard if that's an option. It's gonna have much more of the enzymes and the nutrient profile that you need to make use of what you eat. And in the case of vegetables, you can always add a little bit of fat like olive oil or butter to help absorb what's in them. If you like this video, smash that thumbs up button if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe and follow my channel. And until next time, keep your life in motion. Dr. Ben out.